Here's how you can mirror and record the screen of your Apple Watch to your iPhone. Welcome, welcome everybody to Apple Insider. It is Andrew here, and you can find me on Twitter at Andrew underscore OSU. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and subscribe and enable those notifications so you don't miss a single video. Here, I'm gonna be showing you a really cool trick that is part of watchOS 9 and iOS 16. You'll be able to mirror and record and interact the screen on your Apple Watch to your iPhone. It's amazingly cool and easy to do. As a note, right now, these operating system updates are currently in developer beta. Soon, they'll be available in a public beta before being widely released in the fall of 2022. If you don't have these software updates, you won't be able to use this feature, but be patient, they'll be released soon enough. Now, let's grab my devices and show you how this works. So here's my iPhone running iOS 16. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and we're going to open the settings application. From within settings, you can search here in the search bar, but you can also go down to accessibility. I'm gonna tap on accessibility and then there's a new option for Apple Watch mirroring. As you probably surmised, that's exactly what we're looking for. Now, if I go ahead and toggle this on, I will see my watch appear on screen. So here my watch is connected and I can actually interface with it on my phone. I can do things like scroll using the digital crown. I can tap it to go back to the home screen. I can open up the calendar, again, back to the home screen, jump onto weather, anything like that that you could do on your Apple Watch, you can actually do it straight from your phone. It is so cool that you can just do this by moving the digital crown, tapping, you can hit the side button as well. If you wanna open up the dock on your phone, jump between things that way, interface with the screen, jump into now playing. Everything you can do on your watch face, you can do it while mirrored to your iPhone. While doing this, you'll notice there's a blue border around the watch face on my actual watch, so you do know that it is being mirrored to another device. And if I finish this up, I can go ahead and exit out of my screen recording or my uh, mirroring of the Apple Watch here just by tapping on the little dot. And then if I go to the top, you can actually see this. I was able to take a screen recording while uh, mirroring my Apple Watch to my iPhone. And then if I go into my photos and go to my screen recording, you can see I was able to capture a screen recording of my Apple Watch, which I think is very, very cool. It can be even edited into videos. I'll, here, this is what it looks like on screen. It looks much nicer when you're trying to demo something on Apple Watch. So expect more tutorials with Apple Watch and watchOS uh, 9 here using the new screen recording and screen mirroring feature of iOS 16. So what do you guys think? I think this is one of the coolest features coming inside of Apple's new updates, even if it's minor and something you're not gonna use that often, but it's Pretty sweet to see your Apple Watch show up on your iPhone screen and be able to interact with it in that way, let alone being able to take screen recordings. Let me know if you guys are gonna try this out for yourself. Let me know down below in the comments or on Twitter at Andrew underscore OSU. Otherwise, stay tuned. I have a lot more videos around Apple's new operating systems coming your way.